You see... Taxis are Ubers, the stars are YouTubers, Neil Tyson gave Pluto the axe. The cell phones got smarter, the oceans got hotter, the global economy collapsed. We get internet deals on our hyphenate meals like Kate's free vegan paleo sausage. We don't leave our homes thanks to Amazon drones, they track what we do through our watches. What's going on? Will we be okay? Has it all gone mad since we went away? Oh, update us please and put us at ease cause we've run out of jokes. About the Bad cause of one hanging chad, W hunted for WMDs. Obama brought hope, so Clinton thought dope. 2016 should be a real breeze. So Hillary finally broke that glass ceiling? No, but it certainly does feel like it's raining shards of glass all around us. The country's cut into two, the red and the blue, Facebook's a toxic waste of. The Fox friends are doting, the Russians are voting, and now there's a President Trump. At least we think there's still a President Trump. You see, the writers are writing this in 2018. How is that possible? The people rely on Animaniacs for outrageous and relevant content. Well, how can we finish catching up when we don't know what happened in the last two years? I don't know. Wild guesses? Sounds good to me. We have chips in our brains. We no longer feel pain. There are worsening climate disasters. Now we live underground and we can't make a sound less. We anger our polar bear masters. Here comes South for revenge. We breed birds without arms on our factory farms and we live in aluminum bunkers. We send humans to Mars. All the food comes to Mars and the top rated show is called Clunk. It's about a talking police car. Who's also a time machine. Wow, here comes the star, Clunko. I travel through time, solving crime. <laughs> That's what's going on in the world today. This is crazy now, just when we went away. Our ratings to 